Hi, I'm JJ Snyder, and you're watching Mingo Media TV's Red Carpet Report. Tonight, we're meeting with the actors and producers from the new ABC thriller, Missing. It should be a really interesting night. Team, I have the power team. Hey, you guys. Hi, how are you? Thank you very much. Thank you, thank you. Thanks, we're very excited. It's going well. Great, so now it's time to, to get out into public, lay back and talk about it a little bit, right? Yeah. yeah, it's nice. It's nice. You know, we we've had really good feedback. We have a, a lot of great fans, and this is just a fun way to to meet some of them. And what was it like about a month ago? The show came out on March fifteenth, I believe. And were you a little bit nervous? Is it? Is it well, it's always nerve wracking. You never know how it's going to be received. You work so hard, and then um, put it out there and see what happens. I think that uh, the response has been wonderful. People love the show. Absolutely. I know part of your dream uh, uh, was to produce a more global show, and you've done that by filming in so many different locations. Are you getting feedback on a global level? Oh, well, yeah. Gina, Gina and I just returned from um, Cannes, from MIP TV, and um, we're, you know, their television market, and people uh, kept coming up to us oh saying how much they loved we the show. We love the show. And they cried at the end of episode two, and, and these are men. <laughs> yeah, so, you know, uh, from all over the world, and it really, you know, we were excited to bring, you know, sort of these European locales back to American audiences, but what's also happened is global audiences all over the world have felt very connected to the story and the fact that so much of this show is shot in their own backyards is also really exciting. I thought that while well, I've been watching it is like they get a chance to see to feel what it's like to be in Hollywood but at the Trivi Fountain. Right? When, when, when we first met about this Gina said to me that you know her goal was to make television for the world and not just for the American audience and so we really tried to Tried to do that. I mean, we not only shoot in all these places, but we cast locally, and we have a you know we have we have a lot of actors from a lot of the places that we go to, and uh, so that's we, right. Yeah, so we, it makes for a much more diverse cast. Doesn't it? Right? Yeah, yeah, and, and yeah. a very strong cast. And we made a decision early on to go ahead and you know use subtitles and have people speaking foreign languages and do those sorts of things just to make have it, their accents, yeah, not hide make, their accents. Yeah, you know, to make it seem real. Yeah. Great. Well, we're about halfway through the season right now, and so I guess the season finale is in the can, right? Yes. Yes. In the can. We're done. We, we know what happens. Yeah. <laughs> I know you're not going to tell me. <laughs> it's I can tell kind, you but I have some thoughts. Unbelievable. Yeah, I'd, I'd like to hear your thoughts. I can tell you it finishes in Istanbul. Oh, really? Yeah, episode 10 takes place in Istanbul. Okay, great. Was... See? I did... You just told me something really hot. Something new. You learned something new. Yeah. <laughs> But it was incredible. I mean, an amazing just place to shoot, an amazing yeah. place to shoot. Okay, so you three as a team. Yeah, she absolutely does. I mean, if you had to pick one person here who isn't the boss, who would be the, the boss? Be? Ah! <laughs> I love it. It must be you because you got one. But it's certainly not me. <laughs> Nobody <laughs> pointed at Grant. Poor Grant. All right, I'll point at Grant. <laughs> Hope I didn't cause an argument. I think that, um, you know, this is Greg's first time doing television. Gina and I have done it a little bit before. And... Um, it's a good, it's been a good pairing, you yeah, know. I, I, I yeah, feel I, uh, unlike we're a trifecta. Yeah, we really are a trifecta. We share responsibility. Um, it's gone uh, incredibly well. It's been a great luxury for me to have people with this much experience to sort of prop me up and make me look good. You know. Well, congratulations on the success of the show. Thank you.